So how much money do you need to start investing? What's going on everybody? Welcome back for another video about stock investing. Today we'll talk about how much money you need to start investing. If this is your first time on this channel, my name is Phil and I put out videos like this every single weekend. So make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to learn more about stock investing. And if you like this video and find it helpful, make sure to press the like button. So quite often I've been asked the question, how much money do I need to start investing in the stock market? You know, people tend to think that investing in the stock market is for rich people only, or at least for people with a whole lot of money. And I can say that I was guilty of being one of those people years ago, you know, before I got involved with investing in the stock market myself. Uh, I used to think that to invest, you need a whole lot of money. So when I was looking for ways to make money on my own, investing in the stock market was the last thing I would ever consider doing. Until I, of course, I started doing research on the subject and discovered that, you know, you don't need a lot of money to start investing and you really don't. I don't care if you have $10,000, $1,000, $100 or $10. It's better putting those few dollars you have to work than to let them sit in a bank and do nothing. So here's what you can do. Find a company that you might think will be a good investment. Do as much research on that company as possible. And if you think that it might be a good investment, put that money to work. When you get your hands on more money, buy more stock in that company or another company. You know, it's a good thing to diversify. If you own shares in a company that pays out dividends, well, reinvest those dividends back in that company. And when you continuously do that, you see how those few dollars turn into a little fortune. But of course, 10% return on a $1,000 investment is better than 10% on a $100 investment. But that's how it works. The more money you put in, the bigger the returns. That is, of course, if the company continues to do what it's supposed to do. But the main point is you don't need a lot of money to start investing. You might not have much money to put to work to begin with, but start with what you have. Add more to that investment when possible, and with time and some patience, that little investment will grow. So that's it for today, guys. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, I would really appreciate it if you give it a like. And for more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and talk to you next weekend.